Part two of probably the longest video or longest level for video on uh, of the game with this guide. I don't know if it's necessarily the it took me the longest to beat. You know what? It probably did. The last part of this level is fucking hard. This part two, not too hard. Part three, yeah. Un poco difícil. Oh, your Spanish is excellent. Mm hmm. Thank you. See, you should make our span. You should make a second Spanish guide no. for every guide we do. No, no. I'm just gonna continue to talk in incomprehensible English and Spanish. See, I'm I'm not even doing a good job on the English guide. I don't know why anybody would want to watch the Spanish. Yeah, we mumble. I mean, if you're not American, you probably cannot understand a damn word we say. I've worked on my enunciation recently. <laughs> One black beetle blood, only black blood. So you're kind of coming. Say that before you no, talk? no, I just, uh, <laughs> I, I just mentally try to think about not saying ums and ahs all the well, time. Well, ums and ahs aren't pronunciation. That's no, but I, but I do work on, or not work on it, but I think about, and I do, uh, 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 I do think about you know, speaking more clearly and not mumbling. Like I normally do. You're gonna wanna do this. You're <laughs> gonna wanna do that. So after you come out of this cave, there's gonna be a couple guys off to the left. Baboons to the left of me. Baboons to the right. You've already used this quote too many times. No, but it's such a good quote, and I watched that episode today. <laughs> so... Dude, you should pass some of those DVDs. Not a chance. Not a fracking a chance. Dude, it will help site if I'm up to date on Simpsons. Mm, no. No. Yes. Because I want to look like the superior Simpsons quoter. But you are. I know. I want to stay that way. <laughs> Motherfucker. So if you've already Fracker. used... <laughs> Fracker. If you've already used all your satchel charges uh, on top of that little bunker... Not bunker. Like There's a parachute. No. Supply drop. That's the word I'm looking for back there. Now, you want to after you walk out in the open, you're going to run kind of back up top here. And directly where I'm looking right now is the bunker that you need to blow up. So you're going to kind of make your way all the way around. This one right there, like the, the one right next to me, doesn't have anybody in it, fortunately. So use your height advantage, shoot everyone down below, and then kind of sprint to the bottom and toss uh, some of the C4 or satchel charge, whatever that's called, into the bunker, and then set it off. You press left on the D-pad to bring that satchel charge up. I have an off-topic thing to say. No. I want to talk about the sound effect for the satchel charge, because okay. it's fucking hilarious. Okay. If you haven't thrown the satchel charge, uh, and you press right trigger, it does this vroom, 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 and it kind of sounds like the noise that it makes when you um, when you had those Hot Wheel wind-up cars, oh. and you would like drag them yeah. on the tile in the kitchen. Yeah. Anyway, it makes that noise. So, I played around with that for a while when I was recording <laughs> this level. <laughs> nice. Yeah, this next, this second one's the hardest one, because you have to go uphill a little bit, and there's going to be a bunch of guys down below, and the guys uphill are throwing grenades down at you, and if you're not careful, you're going to get hit with four grenades at once. Two to the left of you, and two to the right. So just kind of, before running up the hill, let them kind of tire themselves out and throw all their grenades. Kill everybody at the bottom of the hill, and then whip out your flamethrower and just sprint up the hill and just kind of dive behind cover. It requires a little bit of luck, but it's easiest way to do it. Okay. So All your right. off-topic comment All right. that I interrupted you for? Oh, uh, it's really off-topic. Skate 2? Mm-hmm. Got patched today. Did it? Yep. They removed the glitch where you do the... What, what was that thing? Where you jump off your board, and then you do a weird oh. trick, and then you go skyrocketing into the air. So they removed the fun. They, they removed the fun from the, the fun game. fun from the game. Exactly. They didn't make that skate challenge easier? I... 
didn't read through it enough. As, as soon as I read God, that, that thing is so fucking hard. Oh yeah. As soon as I read that, they removed that. Um, super bounce. Super bounce. Yes, super bounce. I don't know if games have super bounce. Yeah, what kind of assholes removed that? But I guess they removed it because people were abusing it online. Oh. Because there's like online modes where you try to damage yourself as much as possible, oh. and people were doing that and winning, and other people were playing legit. Shit, I should have done that before today. I was gonna say I started playing it online. And oh, really? It's surprisingly good. Hmm. So much Skate One sucked. <laughs> I just bounced the grenade <laughs> off that <laughs> guy's head. It's, Skate One was awful online, and mm. this one's actually decent. Like you do the tournaments that you do in single player, mm -hmm. but instead of like computers, it's people. Humans. So, human. <laughs> human internet. Human tetherball? <laughs> human dollars. Galgamex. <laughs> or is that different? That, that's a different one. Galgamex is the... Galgamex is the... 13 foot vagina. Filled with razor sharp teeth. Mm -hmm. And the human dollars is Bill Cosby. And the Trapakipa. Everyone has seen Mysterio say, yeah! <laughs> yeah! That was so funny, and I bet Dude. a lot of people didn't get that reference. I bet that guy is so fucking stoked that he was on South Park. Do you think he even knows? I guarantee he must know. Do you he think, knows he's on that video. Do you think he even knows that he was on that video? Yes. Alright, for those who are not aware of what we're talking about, uh, there is this uh, viral video <laughs> that came out a number of years ago before, before even, you know, before... The news organization started paying attention to viral videos, and yeah. there was a name for viral videos. Anyway, there was a in Mobile, Alabama. <laughs> yeah, there was leprechaun sightings, and uh, it was just the most ridiculous thing in the world. It was it's, so funny. They had just like these like mostly black people talking about like how there's like most likely crack whores and not leprechauns <laughs> and like it's probably a crackhead yeah and then it was just hilarious and then there's like remix after remix of this yeah. video i want the go give, give me, me the, the go <laughs> <laughs> and then uh and then that guy got featured on the most recent episode of south park yes which was hilarious and as soon as i saw the commercial for it i was like oh my god the coon dude the coon and mysterio <laughs> so who is mysterio i thought it was stan it's kenny or Kenny, yeah. Or Butters, in no. a weird twist. Because Butters is uh, is in that episode. I know. He's sly he like that. He fights. He fights Mysterio. himself. I know. So, right next to where I'm sitting is an infinite supply of satchel charges. So, if you want to have some fun, throw some satchel charges. Okay. Yeah, have some fun. Throw some satchel charges. <laughs> you have to toss one in there to blow it up, and you know what game you can had use the best satchel lines? charges to kill people. Golden eye. Golden eye. Yes, because they went flying out from you like a. Bullet. And there's like trip mines, like remote mines. Mm -hmm. Proximity mines. Yeah. Proximity times and remote. Yeah. And you'd cover an entire wall <laughs> with the mines. <laughs> And then blow them off at once, and the game's <laughs> frame rate would drop to about two. Oh god, what a good game! They make obviously much better games than that nowadays, but it's it. The, the basics to that game are outstanding. The controls are dated. Oh my god, it's it's impossible to play. But I don't know. But when people, I don't know. Any new Bond game that comes out, some dumb developer says, Oh, this game goes back to its golden eye roots. Bullshit. No, it doesn't, but your game probably is better, but you just can't recreate that kind of nostalgia mm -hmm. that you know we had when we were kids playing that game. Yeah. They have yet to make a good Torah. Oh my god, this voiceover didn't record. Just kidding. <laughs> 